Hey there guys and gals, Traviscraft here, and welcome back to episode 6 of Rise of the Tomb Raider. How are you guys and gals doing? I'm doing alright myself. I just got back from Minecon 2016, Anaheim, California. And it was a blast meeting everyone there. And seeing all the new things, but since this is not Minecraft, uh, I will push that off to the side until the Minecraft series or later on in, in another video <laughs> so last time we escaped the prison we helped to break out uh, a captive which hopefully will help us out later on in the story from what it seems like he is actually gonna be a major help later on in the story just from what I gather so far but anyway, let's continue on with the story. There we go. Get some snapshots in. Throwing a grenade. Grenade out. Missed me. Oh, that was so close. I'm almost there. And I'm dead. Yep, I knew it. Get a couple headshots. Cover me. Up. Pick up. Oh, I'm out of paper. What the hell? Oh hell no! She's alone. Move out. Make it quick. Hang on. Does anyone 
God dang, they just charge you out of nowhere. Guess I don't have to do that first part all over again. Move out. Make it quick. Under fire! Cover me! Suppressing fire! Throw the grenade! Get clear! We got a man down! Taking fire! Oh, that was kind of hard. <laughs> cool, I got some more paper so I can heal myself, which is always nice. Oh yeah, if you shoot those laptops, uh, they, you get a challenge, and yeah, it's a challenge. <laughs> you get rewarded if you destroy 10 of them. Which As I push deeper into the valley, I feel reassured that this is the work I was chosen to perform. My stigmata itch with sensation. It is a constant reminder of my higher purpose, of my singular position in this higher purpose. I was a child, innocent to the evils of the world, then... One night, I woke in such pain, a scream on my lips. Blood dripped from my palms when I saw it. I was terrified. It marked me. It meant something. I cannot shirk this mission any more than I can shirk my own hands. Jacob, I think I'm close to the train yard. Are you there? A badge of rank in a military order. Trinity. Cool looking metal, but it's a Trinity metal, so yeah. Oh, what happened to him? He was just alive a second ago. What in the world is going on? Ah, that's what happened to them. What took you so long? I thought I lost you back there. Not a chance. Thanks for getting me out of that place. Let's move! 
Oh hell, this is one of the chasing stock, oh, god dang it. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Am I gonna make it? Come on, come on, come on. Make it, make it, make it. I made it. <laughs> and I'm freezing cold again. Possibly hypothermia. And I got a helicopter on me. Great. Nope, and I died. Jumped too early. And hit the space bar, but it didn't do anything. What the hell? Oh, I did not make, I almost didn't make that one. Oh, snap. Take it easy. Drink this. It'll help. You could have left me in that river. Would you have left me? I'd have thought about it. <laughs> What makes you think I didn't? <sighs> so what makes you risk so much to come here? The divine source. I know what you're looking for. But I want to know why. 
When I was young, it was just my father and I. He was an archaeologist too. In his last years, he was obsessed with myths about immortality. Of course, no one believed him, including me. Our last conversation was a fight. He... He took his own life. I thought I'd come to terms with it, but... Something else happened. And I saw something that I thought was impossible. It changed everything. I realized my father was right. He died alone and broken. But he died for something. So you believe the divine source is real? I honestly don't know. But if there is any truth to it, I have to find out. It, it, it needs to be researched and studied. It could make a difference to the world. It's not something to be hidden away. A difference is not always for the best. Would you wish Trinity to have the secret to immortality? Of course not. Then I would ask you not to abandon your quest, but to alter its path. Join me and my people. Help us repel Constantine and Trinity. Then after that's done. And you leave our valley untouched. But knowing that you've done the right thing. No, I'm sorry. I can't do that. Can't? Or won't? Ouch. I'll fight Trinity with you, but my goal remains the same. If I give up now... You'd feel like you'd be letting him down. Not just him. I need answers, Jacob. I need to understand. You're leaving. Right now, my concern is for my village. It's over the mountain pass. A day's journey on foot. But there may be a faster way through the old copper mine. You rest. I'll be back soon. Jacob, are you there? Damn it. Where is he? Okay, well. That was a fun little cutscene there. And I also, when I got this game, I got the DLC, the Baba Yaga, which includes an alternate storyline, or, um,. Kind of like a separate story all together. I think I am going to go ahead and do that. Since it's open right now. Before we move along with the story. Just as a fun little thing. Jacob's gone ahead. There's something about him that I can't quite put my finger on. It's strange, but almost comforting. Like I could tell him anything, and it wouldn't faze him. I sense no judgment from him. Yet, at the same time, he's hard to read. My instincts tell me he's a good man. He saved my life. I think I can trust him. At least for now. But I can't shake a nagging feeling that he knows more than he's letting on. I 
I'm just looking at the skills, just trying to figure out which one I want, and then we'll continue on. I figure I'll go ahead and get the double head, double shot. Be able to take out enemies a little quicker. <laughs> and we are back in this map area. Like I said earlier, uh, and. Don't shoot. I'm with Jacob. He told us to wait for you, but these bastards found us first. Oh, God. Are you all right? I'll live. But I need a safe place to rest, in case the invaders return. There's a cave across the bridge over there. A wolf den. They won't look there. But I can't clear it out on my own. Not like this. If you could kill them, we'll have a safe place to regroup. I might even have something for that pistol of yours. Can you help us? Of course I'll help. Yes, of course. Stay out of sight. I'll be back. Thank you. Oh, okay, that's where it's at. Jacob was right about you. <laughs> Do not let the target slip away. We need to know why they were following Bravo. <laughs> oh, yeah, Bravo and Trinity is here. Great. Here, Wolfie, 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 where you at? somewhat easy enough. Let me just scan them really quick. I was waiting for some wolves to come up behind me. Glad none did.
Oh crap. They saw me. Head there now, you'll be safe. Thank you. Here, take this. Jacob told us to protect you, but you weren't the one who needed it. Molly's 300 XP and a new thing for my pistol. Heck yeah. Oh crap, I didn't see that guy there. Hold on just a second. Two guys there. Gotta find this person. Mm, let's see. Got to be hiding in here ah, somewhere. Right there. Maybe this trail. <sighs> no. Nope. Nothing. Definitely big enough to hide in. Oh well, it would be easier if I followed the blood trail. Blood. can see the cylinder is empty. The firing pin never worked anyway. You hurt. I just need to sit down for a moment. Lara, was it? I'm Nadia. I could use your help. What can I do? My grandfather snuck out of the village in the night. I think he's headed for the Wicked Vale, where the witch Baba Yaga lives. I was trying to catch up with him when the invaders caught me. Before I was born, the witch killed my grandmother. Grandpa always talked about revenge, but I never thought he'd actually go through with it. There isn't much time, and I'm in no condition to go myself. We have to find him. And, of course, I will accept this mission. I'll head out that way and see if I can pick up his trail. Oh, thank you. The path to the Vale is through the cave to the east of here. All right, guys and gals, and that's it for this episode. Um, we took out some guys, Trinity, and died a lot. Not as much, well, maybe as much as some of the other episodes. <laughs> but yeah, so now we're gonna be doing the alternate uh, story, Baba Yaga. Laura, have you gone out to look for my grandpa? No, not yet. But I will. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, until next ex episode, I will see you when I see you.